We will be arriving at the restaurant soon, my dear. <sighs> How long ago was it since we've last gone out? It feels like a million years ago, doesn't it? Well, when you don't age, it's <laughs> hard to tell. Time just passes faster and faster and faster and there's no real reason to care but for you my love <laughs> I will care you look just as beautiful as the first time we saw each other my dear your dress is just Splendid. It fits you perfectly. It goes so well with your hair and your beautiful face. <laughs> oh, my dear. Oh, am I glad humans invented night restaurants <laughs> that we may visit? Going outside at night is fun, but it can get pretty lonely sometimes. <laughs> Although our daily walks are the best part of my day. My beloved, we will be arriving at the restaurant soon. Make sure to hide your teeth. <laughs> you don't want others to know that you're a vampire. Although humans stopped believing in vampires, so if we went in there, they'll think we're dressed up as something that doesn't exist. So maybe. Maybe it's a good thing human don't fear us anymore. We can do whatever we want to do. <laughs> Going out at night in human society a few hundred years ago, they would have buried us alive. Yet, here we are, going to a human restaurant, eating food that even the richest king couldn't even imagine eating now for a few what is today's currency dollars <laughs> worthless pieces of paper not even gold humans ha ah, they truly are silly oh i guess it is the problem when you are not a mortal you just don't understand the real value in objects but I do I know that no objects and no amount of money in this world will ever buy a second of time with you my beloved you are everything I need my most prized position. <laughs> well, it's been a long time since you've been a servant, haven't you, my dear wife? It's been a long time since we've known each other. You used to be the prettiest girl in the entire village. I remember when I made you my wife, you were so were a little scared about me being a vampire after all. but living forever being young forever that's not as scary as it sounds is it <laughs> just you and me for all of eternity and I say that all the gold in the world cannot buy a second of time with you 
but they can buy other things like this nice dinner we're going to get can you imagine a few hundred years ago meat you had people going their entire life without even tasting it now they can just go and eat it every day it's crazy no one in the field no one wasting their lives everyone just living spoiled having everything they want like they're all just small little kings enjoying their lives well after so many years of working for us i think peasants deserve it they deserve to be spoiled they deserve to eat meat every day they worked for it well their ancestors worked for it i don't think they work very hard <laughs> Well, my views of this world were outdated a thousand years ago, so <laughs> I don't think I can really say anything about it. How do you feel about it? Do you think they're a little bit too spoiled? Ah, <laughs> uh, who knows? Maybe, maybe one of them is having a very hard time. Maybe one of them doesn't have a home. Who knows? It's very hard to judge people based on looks alone. Sometimes people seem so happy, but are so sad on the inside. Sometimes some people seem to have everything, but... They're missing that little something. I guess it's why we should treat everyone with kindness. Hmm, dear? Well, if I hadn't treated you with kindness, I, uh, I would have never met you, so... Hmm, maybe being kind is what really matters. Hmm? <laughs> we'll be arriving in about... What? Two, three minutes? Ah, my dear. It is nice to see you smile. To see you again. I would gladly brave a thousand storm just to be with you. <laughs> I'd rather lose everything and to lose you again. You are the only thing that matters to me and, well, without you, my life is pointless. <laughs> I have nowhere to go. I have no one to see. You make everything worth it, my dear. I know I say that a lot, but it is important for me to tell you how much I love you. I promise I'll stop now, my dear. For today, of course. Tomorrow. Perhaps I'll tell you how much I love you. <laughs> Start today with that. All right, my dear. We've made it to the restaurant. Such an amazing place. Wow. So cheap, too. One gold coin is around... Mm, 20... 100,000. Wow. There's a lot of money. Well... I guess it isn't a lot of money, since one gold coin can really buy you that much. 
but who cares? <laughs> Let's enjoy ourselves, dear. <laughs>